Welcome back. Many of us are guilty of tossing out our Thanksgiving leftovers, but this year we're showing you how to reinvent leftovers, giving your favorite dishes a second chance. Wait a minute. You mean there's more than just turkey sandwiches? Yes. Here to show us some easy to do recipes is Chef Mushea. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Well, thank you. Oh, Pleasure. look at this, a handshake and everything. <laughs> yes. Well, it just smells delicious. Thank you, thank you. So thank why you. don't we start with some of the options we have instead of those, as I mentioned, turkey sandwiches, which I swear we ate for like a week <laughs> after Thanksgiving. Well, yeah, you have to have fun and just, you know, that's a lot of food to throw out. I know, you and know? you don't want to so, waste it no, either. No, you don't. And I mean, it's a good food. It's hearty food, so we can preserve it by putting it in the freezer, coming back to some of the stuff. These wraps look delicious. So we did, we took some of the turkey shredded it, added some romaine, onions. We did up a, a, a balsamic cranberry dressing Oh. and added it to that. Okay. We took the leftover macaroni and cheese that you have here. Right. And we did some <gasps> macaroni and cheese balls. Oh my God. So those are pre-rolled and we rolled them in panko flour. So that helps it stick? Yep. Because like clearly I'm not the, the cook here. It's all right. But so that helps it sort of just uh, Kind of gives it a different taste, would yeah. you say? Yeah, it's like appetizer. It's really good. Okay. Like almost like a cheese stick. Oh, right. Okay, right. cool. Yep. So then we took the collard greens, right? Right. But the, nobody knows what to do with collard greens. No. We whipped them up, give you the um, illusion of like a spinach dip. Right. So That's what it, it looks like. It's a collard green dip. And so, okay, I, mean, I was going to ask how does it taste, but I might Amazing. as well try it for myself. Mmm. Mm, mm, mm. Then we did the ham and cheese sliders with the leftover um, ham, leftover cheese you normally have for your macaroni, throw that shredded cheese on there, pop them in the oven. So is there somewhere people can go to get these ideas or recipes or how, you know, how, how do you create this at home? How do you go from this to this? I'm a thousand pounds at heart, <laughs> right? So I, I mean, all? I'm just extremely, I'm a foodie. So I mean, you know, I came up with it, the turkey pot pie. That's like my all time favorite. All right. I mean, you can, I, I, you can reach out to me through Instagram. Okay. Um, I can send some recipes to WDIV. So Pastable offering up some wonderful suggestions yes. today for things that you can do. And again, you can turn some macaroni and cheese. And what was the name for this one? Just the macaroni and cheese fried balls. Oh, okay. Very <laughs> creative. I like right? that. And so like we are Pastable. We specialize in Italian soul cuisine. So. Okay. Mr. B Soul Food, that's my partner. Right. He do, uh, donated the soul food goods so that we can make this happen this morning. Well, that's great. Well, thank you so much for joining us this morning. And I think it's fantastic to find different ways to sort of use up all of those leftovers. Right, yeah. Because sometimes you end up with a lot. You end up with a lot. All right. Well, yeah. thank you so much, okay. Chef Mushea, for joining you. us so early this morning. Sean, mm -hmm. I'll send it back to you.